Well, hello everybody. Welcome to another episode of my bucket list day. So before we get started, I would like to take this opportunity, um, unbeknownst to Jeffrey, I first off would um, more than anything else like to applaud Jeff and um, I'm so proud of him for stepping out and talking about what is so very near and dear to our hearts. Um, he explained it perfectly. We are all definitely um, patriots and love our country. Um, and that's the great thing about our country is that we have the freedom to um, vote, right? So um, congratulations and kudos um, for all of your strength and standing up for what you believe in, sweetheart. Next thing I want to do um, is I would really like to thank all of you that showed your support because I can't even tell you how anxious and how nervous he was about doing it for all the reasons he spoke about and I just told you. And we certainly didn't mean to offend anybody. Everybody's got a right to feel the way they do. Um, our only, I uh, guess, I think his method to all of the madness is spread the word because every vote counts. Again, thank you so much for all of your kind words to Jeff um, and us and supporting us. Um, thank you for those not dropping out that didn't agree with our or support um, how we feel. I do want to say this though. Um, one thing that Jeff really hadn't uh, mentioned or maybe just barely touched upon. I personally am um, just saddened. Um, of how we are so um, divided as a country and all of the hatred that is spoken. Um, I can tell you, no matter where it's being slung from, it's wrong um, and all it does is create more hatred. But um, anyway, that's about it. I hope everybody had a most blessed um, Labor Day. We most certainly did. It was fun. It was quiet, but it was nice. So, um, loved Reno, loved Carson City, all of it. So, you folks, um, blessings to all of you, and make sure you go out and vote. That's all I'm going to say. You, and now I'm going to let Jeff take over. See ya. All right, for those of you that are new to this channel, we are running a contest to give away two event and cinch bikes like this. So, all you have to do is watch the video and look for the icon like this, which is a little cinch bike, and it'll have a letter or a number or an image on top of that. So look for that and keep track of those throughout the video. Now those clues are randomly put in the video in any location. Could be at the beginning, could be in the middle, the end, or all of those things in there. But, but somewhere in the video you're going to see at least one clue. There's usually multiple clues, but look for it and remember what it is so you can enter it into the form. And then when you're all done, all you have to do is go to this link right here. I'll have it below, but you go use this QR code, scan it on your phone, and it'll take you right there, and you fill out the entry form to win the bikes. And at the bottom there, in the form, it's going to let you put in the clues that you saw from this episode. And don't forget to put that episode number. It's very important to organize your answer, whether it's right or wrong. So have fun. Enjoy the video. And look for those clues. Remember, it's going to be a little cinch bike like this with a letter, a number, or an image on top of it. All right, back to the video. <laughs> hey, all. Hi. So we're here in South Lake Tahoe. So we decided to do just an impromptu little road trip. Yeah, get away. And uh, we really were get in away. Just get out. North Lake Tahoe just a, a couple hours ago. We were in Incline Village. And uh, Joe took a little film. We'll show that here a later. Incline Village is gorgeous, isn't yeah. it? It's, mm -hmm. it's really, really pretty. If you ever come to Lake Tahoe, go on up there. Um, I'll admit, it's kind of the ritzy area of the lake. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> You're going to see some magnificent properties. You have to have a couple of mills just to look at the lake. Yeah. It's, just to view it. It's uh, pretty incredible up there. But So we just thought we'd bring you guys along on our little day trip. To Lake Tahoe, and we're in okay. South Lake Tahoe. Personally, it's beautiful, yeah. but it's not as pretty as North. Would you agree or disagree? No. Oh yeah, sure, I do. Yeah. But it, um, the, the day is beautiful. The weather is perfect. Right. And we didn't bring the right camera with us, so I'm going to turn it around, 
so you can see it in the mountains all the way across the lake but it's not going to do it justice so i apologize we didn't bring the right camera for this but here you go And that brings you back to us. Oh, swallowing my juice. That's all right, your juice. <laughs> your soda pop. My, I don't look, look she's got pop. a big soda pop. <laughs> what? I don't drink soda pop. Why are you always drinking when you're on film? <laughs> That's right. Remember somebody said on film I was always drunk because I was slurring? Yes. And for those of you who said that, there was only two of them that said that. Yeah, but some people still don't know that. Some newcomers. Yes, so if you hear her slurring her words... Slurring or lisping It could be because she's drinking, but most of the time... It's because she's learning she's, how to speak. She's learning how to speak again because she had to have a big chunk of her tongue removed from cancer. Yes. And now she's learning to speak again. Hey, Taylor. Yeah. So that's why she slurs <laughs> a little more than you do. Okay, I hope it's not too bright behind us, but here we are in, they call it Cave City or Cave something or another. Tahoe. Taking Tahoe. a little break here. Nice little Nevada park where they have a boat ramp. Oh, there we go. Wow. How pretty that is. Well, we'll pan around here and let you see all of this. There's Joe reaching for that brass ring. Hey everybody, welcome back. So I apologize, I'm squinting a bit. It's kind of bright out here and I forgot my sunglasses. But um, that was our little uh, journey around Lake Tahoe. As we said, we started up in the Incline Village, gorgeous, gorgeous area. I've been there uh, several times myself in the past and uh, wanted to share it with Joanne and the rest of you. So hope you enjoyed. Um, a short little trip. We were down in uh, around the Carson City area and just took a jaunt over there and showed her the lake. So I want to step in and say a couple things about my last video. Got a lot of comments. And in the beginning of this video, Joanne uh, said a few kind words and was uh, on board of the whole thing. Anyway, I just want to encourage all of you to spread the word. Get everybody out there that you know to get out and vote. A couple of you commented, lab because of the last election, who can rely on the voting system? I ask all of you to stop that. Get out and vote. Your vote does count. And get everybody you can to go with you to vote. Since I put that video out, there's been a lot of things going on in the news that uh, 
people on the other side of the aisle uh, have been doing things calling uh, people like myself violent and always stirring up and rioting, which we don't do that. And they're just doing that to get your goat and try to spin the narrative. Ignore that. Stay like you've always been. Stay calm. Speak the truth. Speak with facts. And show up and vote. That's all I can say about that. So, thank you very much for tuning in. Help me spread that word. And don't forget about the contest that we're running right now. We're giving away two cinch bikes from Event. Uh, these are great e-bikes that uh, most RVers are going to love because they fold up nice and compact so you can store them. So, if you want to win those bikes, go ahead and click the links. I'll put it up here again. The little QR code takes you right to the form to fill out to enter the contest. And if you've missed the clues from all the other episodes, go back and look at those so you can figure out what we're saying and what we're trying to uh, spell out. So again, thanks for tuning in, thanks for watching, and we appreciate all of your support. Don't forget to do all those things. Be the Click Monster. Like, subscribe. Actually, we should do like, subscribe, and ring that little bell like we've always done. And uh, that bell will notify you the next time we're putting a video out. Thanks for watching and make it a great bucket this day. Bye.